Good morning. Freshly awake. It is Thursday. It is such a busy day. And I just thought I'd vlog, have some fun, exciting things to share, as well as I just gotta give a shout out to if you haven't seen my last main channel video, I did a like 30 favorite Amazon home products. I'll have that link. There's a lot of great finds in that video that I haven't shown in vlogs. But these like hue light bulbs that I've used for a really long time did not know until very recently that you can actually set like a wake up routine. So for 20 minutes starting at like 8, 10 to 8, 30 or something like that, I have them like slowly start to dim up. So I wake up before my alarm every single day and it is so nice because it feels like you're just like naturally waking up because it's like a sunny warm tone light. I don't know, compared to just like a harsh sudden alarm, it just feels very like very pleasant to wake up this way. My first thing up today is just some editing. So I'm just gonna actually do that from bed. Can we hit 100,000 this year on the vlog channel? I would love to. <laughs> it's now like 11. I was editing for this coming weekend on my main channel. I'm doing my decorating my house for Christmas video. And now I have something that I'm so excited about that I'm about to shoot for Instagram that I'm gonna tell you guys about here too. I feel like at this point, if you've watched like really any of my like moving vlogs, you know how much I love West Elm. They emailed me about doing like a sponsorship. A sponsorship? And I am literally thrilled. I literally, I could not believe it. I was like, this is too good to be true. I've had my little fireplace <laughs> video going while I've been editing. But not only that, but the like post is about how fresh beauty products, like the or skincare products, whatever. This brand right here, about how it's now available on West Elm's website. I, this is one of my favorite skincare brands. They like sent over a few things from West Elm to include too, including some of their like washcloths and hand towels and stuff. Literally in the shade, I already bought of the exact same towel for my bathroom. When that goes up on Instagram, please show it some love if you feel so inclined because I want to work with them every day for forever. I spend literally so much money there. All right, some time has passed and I'm done with all my like filming and editing. So that feels wonderful for the week. It's been like, I would have vlogged more this week, but it's been truly the busiest week with just like, I don't know, just a lot going on. I put on some makeup just to like feel more put together because I was working from my bed a lot today and then realized I'm about to actually work out. I'll tell you about another like fitness challenge thing I'm taking on in a second. But first I wanted to thank Anna Luisa for sponsoring this video. I partnered with them on a vlog not too long ago, like a month or two ago. If you're not familiar with them, they are a jewelry company and I have been wearing their pieces literally every day. These earrings I showed in the last video as well as a necklace and a ring. I just picked out four new pieces from them and I'm super excited about. So if you're wanting more jewelry for yourself to like ask somebody else for for Christmas or you just need some gift ideas in general, this is a very affordable and good quality way to do it as well as just with a company that does a lot of good as well. They're a very sustainable company. They offset 100% of their carbon emissions all the way from sourcing their metals to like product disposal. Everything's also made of noble metals and pieces start at only $39. And then of course, if you want something you know, a little fancier, a little bigger, um, you can work your way up there. But four items I got this time. Brief pause, since when are my nails like not black? Has anyone noticed? I've gotten comments about it. My nails used to be black for like years and years. And then just like this whole year, 2020 did it to me. I don't know. I need to actually redo these here in a little bit because they're chipping. But first up, because these are super similar to the earrings that I have in, the stuff from them has been my favorite. The ones I have on currently have a star and a moon. And these are just two little lightning bolts, a little edgy, a little cute. And I just like that it's like a small hoop, but just with like a little bit of flair. You know what I mean? So I'm going to see what these look like. Actually putting these in like my second hole so that I have like two dangly ones right beside each other. We'll get a feel for that. And then another pair of earrings. I've been wanting to get a little like snake gold pair of earrings for so long. I don't know why. I just think they're so cute. Sometimes I find myself and I'm like going somewhere wanting to like dress up my earrings a little bit more from just like what I wear day to day, but not wanting like a huge hoop or like something like that. So I thought this would be a good little in between, just like a fun earring. Next, I also got this ring. I love the rings. Something that's really cool about this one is that you can just adjust it. So I'm thinking I'm probably gonna wear this on my middle finger, but I just wear so many dainty rings day to day with the exception of like on my middle finger, I usually wear one that's like a little more to it. And I thought that this would be a good addition. You can kind of see the texture here. And then lastly, I just got a little necklace. I wanted like a simple day to day necklace just this little V, super cute, nice thin gold chain. So if you're interested in any of these pieces, I'm gonna have them linked below. They're also having a really great Black Friday sale coming up, so you can go ahead and write that down, set a little calendar reminder, bookmark the page, whatever you need to do, because you can get these at better prices than ever. So my link will be below. Thank you so much again to them for partnering with me on this, because I really love this brand. And now I'm going to get on to my workout. I'm actually doing, um, this will probably go up in like the beginning of December, but I'm over Chloe Ting 
We had our fun. We tried our workouts, you know, and I, I liked a lot of them, but I'm over her. I'm also sweating at the moment, if you can tell. I'm taking a big side note right here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring it back to the workout, but temperatures here have been like high, then low, then high, then low. Now I think they're cool again. So we've been flipping back and forth between having like our air or our heating on. And you guys remember, I always said my room was the coldest when our air was running. It's also the hottest. So downstairs does not feel this hot. Like the heat and the AC really works in this bedroom. Don't particularly love it. I'd love to, you know, average things out here a bit. The rest of our house is not this hot right now and I'm just warm. So this might be like a hot yoga type workout because I'm about to just do this in my room. A new fitness challenge I've been seeing just in my recommended people doing these like, I think her name's like Daisy Keach butt workout type things where I watched the video, it doesn't seem too crazy. I feel like I don't know if it's gonna do anything. I also know I say that at the beginning of most of these challenges and do not feel that way by the end. <laughs> not gonna say too much about this. Stay tuned to that main channel video, but yeah, just know that that's in the works. So I'm gonna go work out. I will say for one move, I am tired of this budget. <laughs> done <laughs> finish the workout this is gonna be an interesting video <laughs> i think i'm now just gonna sit outside i feel like finally chill this whole week has been just so back-to-back -back, like tasks and whatnot i think i'm gonna take some time to just sit on my balcony or maybe go outside we did get our outdoor furniture in i'll give you a little peep this is just my little balcony space outside my room and then way down here we're starting to get some of our patio stuff set up do you hear the squirrel do you hear that? The part of me that has a brain knows I should rinse off right now instead of waiting for my sweat to dry on me. That's gross. But I hate that the sun is gonna set so soon, so I feel like I need to take advantage of like being able to be outside while I can. Drinking some Spindrift. The strawberry one's my favorite. Highly recommend. Literally tastes so good. I was also just thinking about how nice a little peppermint hot chocolate would be <laughs> to just like sip downstairs and like watch something later. And then I went to order it on the Starbucks app and that is 440 calories. And I'm not someone who's like some crazy calorie counter, live your life, treat yourself, whatever. But that is crazy. If you would have had me guess, like I would have not guessed almost 500 calories. Am I still gonna get it sometimes? For sure. But just like, you know, sometimes when you just want like a little treat, I feel like that's why I get coffee half the time. Like just like a little cold brew because I just think it sounds fun. It's like a little treat. That's crazy. All right, dinner. My reward for a long week. I'm literally watching Jersey Shore looking at the Christmas tree. Oh, I wasn't gonna show that. Okay, you saw part of it. <laughs> All right, I'm freezing. And also I still need to rinse off. So I think I might just take a bath. <laughs> so I've not used her in a minute. So after this, like how am I supposed to move out of this place? You know what I mean? Like. How am I supposed to do it? <laughs> this is today's bath time read. I like poetry books, but I never like take the time to read them, literally unless I'm taking a bath. Just because I feel like I don't want to sit here for no time, I want to sit here for a while, you know what I mean? So I need an activity, so poetry has been the activity. <laughs> also, I've been laying on it, so it's messing out, but thank you for everyone who left feedback about how I should do my bed. I've been tucking it in all the way around, we can kind of see. Whatever, it's a mess right now. I need to paint my nails, that's up next. But first I'm having some dessert in bed, in a white bed. Is that smart? Definitely not. But Shelby made these brownies a few days ago and I've been living off of them at night. All right, it's now nail time. I just use a little gel at home kit. Here's the before. I'm watching the Savage Fenty fashion show. I've been wanting to watch this for so long on Amazon Prime and it took until today when I just tried to go on Netflix and both of my sisters are already logged on and that's our uh, max number of screens. So can't watch Netflix. Thought I'd try Amazon Prime. Here's my nail update. Looks pretty good if you ask me. We've reached the end of our day. It's like 9.30, which is the time I've been going to bed lately. <laughs> me and all my roommates here go to bed so early. It is like, it's just a house of grandmas. I don't know what it is. <laughs> but I just wanted to end this vlog on a little, like, I guess just sentimental note for myself that maybe can be a good reminder to everyone watching. I was just like, sitting here thinking about how much I've gotten done this week. Cause it's literally been like the busiest week. I mean, it's about to be the holidays. Like go figure that's like, the busiest time and I have literally gotten more work done this week than I've gotten done in like the entire year it feels like and what I haven't shown you guys this week or in my like last Friendsgiving vlog let's check that out if you didn't see it something happened last Friday so the day before my last vlog that has been very difficult insert a few clips of 
the mom the low moments here but i was just sitting here thinking about how i'm very proud of myself for i don't know just a lot's going on and i don't want to cry right now but i just feel very proud of myself that like i've been able to like feel what i'm feeling when i'm feeling it but also to be able to like push through and get like an insane amount of work done this week and i just feel like we all should you know be cognizant of the times that we deserve to pat ourselves on the back whether it's for a small thing whether it's for like a really big thing only you know what's going on in your life in your head in your heart <laughs> and um yeah if no one's told you this week i'm proud of you and proud of myself and we gonna get through it so that's that and on that note probably gonna go cry <laughs> But thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. Maybe leave some comments below, just general questions. Just so that in future vlogs, I feel like it's fun to like answer some, do like some mini little Q and A's throughout. So it'll be good to have some of those on hand. Love you all. That's it. Have a great week and I will see you in my next vlog.